With a terrain editor, you can quickly add or modify outdoor terrain, such as mountains, rivers, forests, and plains, within a level. Here we see a world that already has some interesting terrain that we can modify. The first thing we'll do is open the terrain editor window and enable terrain editing. The terrain editor window allows you to raise and lower terrain, flatten terrain, smooth terrain, add noisy terrain, and paint or erase textures as layers and decorations. Let's first raise some terrain. We select the Raise Lower button. We can specify a brush radius that controls how much terrain we raise or lower at a time. We can also specify how hard or soft the brush is, that is, how quickly the brush falls off from the central circle to the outer circle. And we can specify the height raised for each click. Simply click the left mouse button and drag to raise terrain. You can control click and drag to lower the terrain. Now, let's flatten some terrain. When flattening terrain, we also specify a brush radius and a brush softness. Notice that it flattens everything that we click and drag over. Now, let's smooth some terrain. When smoothing terrain, we also specify a brush radius and a brush softness. In this case, we specify a softness of zero so that we only have a single circle. Notice that it's smoothing over all of the terrain that we click and drag over. Next, you might decide that it's a little too smooth, so let's add some noise. When adding noise, we specify a brush radius and a softness, the number of noise features that are added with each brush stroke, the scale of these features, an octave for the number of iterations of the features, and the persistence, which defines the shape of the noise features. Together, these specifications define how rough or smooth the added noise should be. After defining basic terrain, you can add layers and decorations to make the world look more realistic. Layers allow you to paint textures on the terrain and decorations allow you to add features on top of a terrain. Let's paint some snow on our noisy mountain range we defined here. Select the texture from the Layers tab, select Paint Erase, then click and drag. You can remove a selected texture by control clicking and dragging. Having painted some snow, let's add a little rock. Now let's add some glacier texture. You can paint textures on any terrain you like. The layers are additive. Now let's add some decorations, for example, bushes and trees. Select the texture from the Decorations tab, select Paint Erase, then click and drag to add bushes all over. Since we've added too many bushes, we can remove them by control clicking and dragging. Finally, let's turn off the terrain editor so that we can look around and see what we've created.